Hey guys, welcome back to another video tutorial. Now you must be familiar with this symbol and you must have seen it in your books arranged in this manner in a half and full bridge rectifier. Yes, it's a diode, which is a passive device and allows the flow of current in one direction only. But since there are so many types of diode, how to differentiate between them and most importantly, which one to use according to its requirement in our circuit. So in this video, we are going to see Dina diode and when to use one. But before jumping to its type, let's see some basic specifications of a diode. First, VF, which indicates forward voltage drop when current flows from P terminal to N terminal. That's why it's called forward voltage drop. IF, which is the maximum forward current a diode can handle. VR, it is the reverse breakdown voltage when current flows from N terminal to P terminal. That is in reverse direction. IR, the quantity of current flows when diode is reverse biased. That means when current flows in reverse direction. And at last, reverse recovery time, which I'll explain later. Short key diode. This is the symbol of short key diode. Now it looks similar to a rectified diode, but there are many differences between a short key and rectified diode. Unlike a rectified diode, junction of short key diode is between n-type semiconductor to metal plate. Short key diode, also known as barrier diode, is used mainly in low voltage circuits because forward voltage drop of short key diode is less than a rectified diode, typically in the range of 0.25 to 0.5 volt. Whereas in the rectified diode, this range is between 0.7 to 0.9. Also, electrons are the majority charge carriers on both sides of the junction. Thus, it is a unipolar device. It is mostly used in high frequency applications like in a SMPS. And that's because of less temperature rise and high switching speed pertaining to its small recovery time. Now, what is recovery time? When a diode is suddenly switched off, it takes a small amount of time for the forward current flowing through the diode to die down and the time taken for this is called reverse recovery time. Compared to normal diode, reverse recovery time of short key diode is much smaller and thus making it suitable to be used in fast switching circuits. Now disadvantage of short key diode is its low breakdown voltage, usually between 20 volt to 40 volt, making it unsuitable for a rectifier circuit. As an example, let's say we are designing a buck converter like we did in one of the previous video. Now since MOSFET in that circuit switching with a very high frequency, diode you need in that circuit must have high switching speed and thus short key diode is an optimum choice. And with that being said, now you know all the basic and when to use Dina diode. You can also check blog post for quick review, link is in description. And if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe. Until then, I see you next time. Bye bye.